Welcome to the Burn and Cliffs Moor UNESCO Global Geopark here in the west of Ireland. We're celebrating UNESCO's International Geodiversity Day. It's being celebrated by 177 UNESCO Global Geoparks across 46 countries all over the globe. We're here looking at the limestone. It makes up a big part of our geopark. And this limestone was formed way down near the equator, 6,000 kilometers away, over 330 million years ago. So it took a lot of plate tectonic movements for it to get where it is today. And when we look at the limestone here, we see all these cracks in the limestone. These were formed during that plate tectonic movement process by compression of the rocks. Those cracks then are being dissolved by rainfall. So when it rains here, that rain falls and it dissolves the limestone. And that dissolved limestone then flows underground, flows out to sea and out. And the limestone that's being dissolved is then used by the animals that are living offshore, making their shells today. We are now here at the other significant geological feature of the Burning and Cliffs of Moher UNESCO Global Geopark, and we're looking at part of the Cliffs of Moher. So these are sandstones and shales, not limestone. The limestone is buried underneath. So these were sediments that were deposited on top of the limestone, filling in that ancient tropical sea. They were eroded by rivers from long distance, long gone mountains to the south of us. And they deposited these layers and layers and layers, which filled up over millions of years to give us the Cliffs of Moher as we see them today. Over a million visitors come here to look at the cliffs. They're looking at geology, they're looking at geodiversity. So come and have a look for yourself.